everybody! As you probably know, it's me, the Red Mage Crow, and welcome back to Danganronpa, where Makoto Naegi is worried about the two of them. He, they hurried to the dining hall more quickly than usual, and when they entered... <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about, bro? <laughs> What are you talking about, bro? What the? Yo. Hey, Makoto! <laughs> Thank you so much for acting as our witness yesterday! Huh? Are they friends now? <sighs> oh man, I forgot I had to do voice. It's been a long time, okay? Mm, let's see. They've been like this all morning. They're all buddy buddy as soon as they walked in. It feels gross. What? Feels gross? Hell no! Feels great, more like! <gasps> this almost feels like sexual harassment somehow. How? Haha! <laughs> <laughs> Forget her, bro! A girl like her just doesn't get our manly bond. You hear me? Friendship between men is stronger than blood! A woman could never understand! Ain't that right? What you just said. Bro, that was cool as turd. I should get a tattoo of it! Oh man, it's already like affecting my throat. No! Without a doubt. No, bro, you mustn't! Your body is a temple given to you by your loving parents. So, um. Who won the contest? Piece of shit! Who gives a turd? Got it! Yeah, don't ask stupid questions! What matters is we both took part in it together. That's completely different from what you were saying last night. Wait a minute. I see. Friendship between men seems very simplistic. Nothing like what I'm used to with girls. Yeah, for real. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Men bond through fights and women bond through socializing. Unless they're antisocial. In which they make friends with gamers. Online. Probably over Chrono Cross. But that's just me being like... To, you know, suggest... That's just me assuming, so, you know, <laughs> let me go ahead and push that through. All throughout breakfast that morning, the room was dominated by Mondo and Taka's overpowering brotherhood. All in all, it was a pretty fortunate experience. Yeah. So, what should I do today? Oh, ding dong! Hmm? Who could that be? Wondering who had come to visit, I opened my door and someone forced their way in. Oh? Oh, hey, Toko! T Toko? What's the matter? What's your problem? Why are you so, so surprised? Am I really that annoying? <laughs> well, I already know I'm annoying. I came here knowing that, so... That makes it uh, okay. Oh, you're not annoying. Just wondered what was going on. <laughs> I have a, a, a favor to ask. I want you to g go somewhere with me. That is not why. That is not B. There we go. Yet again, I'm playing on a Pro Switch controller. So the Y button is supposed to be where the X button is. But... You know, this is obviously like, like they're saying press the A button, but the A button's the B button. And I'm just now noticing how effed up a um, Xbox controller is compared to, um, compared to like a Switch controller. Well, well, the library. Huh? Are you looking for a book or something? Why didn't you just ask Byakuya? 
He spends all his time in the library anyway. Yeah. Did, did I say something wrong? Why are you looking at me with like shock in your eyes and fear in your soul? You're not a blabbermouth, right? This ha has to be a secret. I honestly have no idea what you're talking about. But if you want me to be quiet, I'll be quiet. Me to you. I'm afraid to pat because I feel like she would bite my hand off like some kind of like chihuahua or something. Like honestly, this is one head that I don't think I really want to pat. I want to pat it. You know, kind of like go, Timote. Timote. If you know, you know. And if you don't, I'm sorry, but you need to know. But like, you know, yeah, I'm not petting that. <laughs> Then let's go to the library. Okay, I got it. The library. Jeez, why so pushy? <laughs> quiet. Be quiet when you go in. Don't let him see you. She actually was starting to get annoying. But I did what she said and gently crept into the library. Unsurprisingly, Biakia was there by himself, absorbed in the book. He's here. <laughs> He's really here. Okay, so she sounds more like that. Gotcha. Okay, Makoto, go talk to him. What? Why me? Stop being so loud. Just hurry up and go talk to him. You go talk to him if you want to so bad. And he's probably gonna be like, oh, you know, I know you're both in here. I can't. I don't want to interrupt him. That's kind of crazy. Why? How did you get all the way over there without him noticing? Hello, Biakuya. He seems to be really focused on that book. Doesn't seem like the best time to talk to him. Hey, you. What are you doing back here? I hate even having to look at you. Ah, so you noticed me, Naturally. huh? Of course. Now hurry up and leave. <laughs> and, uh, take her with you, if you could. Hey, um, Biakia? Oh. <sighs> Remember how you said, don't be a woman who dominates a w weak man. Be a woman dominated by a strong man. What the hell am I walking into? I never said that. Well, actually, I just thought it sounded like something you might say. Yeah. Oh... Go take a bath, you smell. Don't make me repeat myself. Don't make me say it again. Go now, before your stench latches onto the entire room. Okay. My ears. He really dug into us there. Maybe he's in a bad mood? I mean, yeah, he probably is. Goodness, man. Oh, God, what the hell? Uh, uh, no, 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 uh, no. Uh, there we go. Togo didn't really say anything, so we didn't really skip anything. She, uh, she seems super depressed. Did he really upset her that much? Yeah, Biakuya, that go to go that far. <laughs> Yet again, I say again, my ears. He must be really concerned about me. Ah! <laughs> he told me to, to take a bath. And everything. You must really care about my w w well being. Uh, 
Hey, M Makoto, what do you think? Think about what? Do you think B Byakuya and I would be g good together? Um, well, now, I, I don't really know. Maybe. That's tr true. There's really no way to know. But the, dis <laughs> the distance between us d doesn't change our love. Because as soon as you realize your feelings, the love is born. And that's how love works. I've already forgotten how she is supposed to sound like. Send help. Oh. Hey? There m might come a day when you understand. Maybe s someday. Uh, oh, it's on auto. I put it on auto somehow. Apparently spacebar is auto. What did you say, you stupid bear? Ah, young love! Ah. Dude, this is already scuffed as all hell. I'm sorry. Who would ever guessed she would go for someone like him? But eager passion can also be scary. Sometimes that leads people off in the wrong direction. He laughed it, not me. All right. All of a sudden, I feel exhausted. Maybe I'll head back to my room for now. Yeah, seems right. There's still some time left in the day. What to do? Well, you know what? I'm gonna go make friends with freaking Toko, I guess. Why? I really do not know. I just... <laughs> Why not, right? Did you come he he here to yell at me? Anyway... My whole life is one un unpleasant experience after the other. Mm, should I hang out with Toko she while she's acting like this? Spend some time with Toko. <laughs> I was perfectly happy spending time by m myself. But I guess if you're so de desperate for attention, I can ha hang out for a little bit. I spent some time with a cold and distant Toko. Oh, that is definitely the best Toko you can definitely get, I guess. I guess. Toko and I grew a little closer today. Can you... Can you not blush at me like that? Okay, I'm back. That was like probably... It's somewhere between four to like maybe eight minutes that that went on. Friend messaged me. Had to reply. Would you like to give her a present? Yes. Definitely. And I'm so glad that the B button definitely does not um... Uh, stop, uh, go automatically to, like, you know, the jazz. Anyways, uh, oh, that's right. Uh, she liked the glasses. Do I have any more glasses? You say incantations will help you speak with the target of your spell. I mean, I have an, I have another one. Yeah, I'm sure. I thought Toko totally hated me. But it's not like she's going out of my way to avoid me. Still, we're not actually talking either. H hey, Toko? I guess that wasn't the glasses that... Uh... What's your problem? W what? You have a question? You have a question for, for your classmate? Uh-huh. Is she happy? So, I kind of asked before, but what do you do like to do in your spare time? <laughs> I just write. I'm serialized, so I'm always really busy. And when I'm not writing, I'm s studying. I'm not an idiot l like you. Yeah. Ah, dang it. I had to go and open my big mouth again. 
You must hate me for sh sure now. Oh, it didn't really bother me. But I can't believe you actually write novels. That people all over the world read them. So, how do you get your ideas for what you write? Is it like real life experience or... Huh? Are you stupid? Nani? <laughs> I t told you, right? Didn't I? I write romance novels. How could I use my, my real life experiences for that? It's all from my imagination. It's just delusions. Delusions let you fall in love as much as you want, even if you never do in real life. Are you just saying you can't write romance unless you already have lots of experience in love? No, not at all. It's okay. I'm used to p people making fun of me, but someday I'll show them. I'll get pretty s someday and show them all. Boiling over like magma, Toko stormed off. This time I'm sure she hates me. Yay! <laughs> Once we were all done, I headed back to my room for a little while. And now for this. Ahem. The school and nighttime is quickly approaching, but before it arrives. This is different. What happened, Monokuma? All students, please gather in the gym immediately. Doesn't that mean somebody's dead? Emergency! Emergency! Pretty sure that means somebody's dead. Gather in the gym. Why now all of a sudden? I really don't like the sound of this. I have a terrible feeling. So do I. Unfortunate. Oh, hey, girl! Oh, Kyoko, did you hear the announcement just now? Indeed. Yes. I don't... I don't want to go, but... You don't have any other choice, right? Right. I can't imagine it's going to be good news. But it's not a good idea to defy him here and now. Goodbye. Well, I'm going on ahead. I really can't do anything except what Monokuma tells me. Maybe we should take a look around. Gotta make sure that we talk to whoever it is that we can. I mean, like, what if there's, um... Oh. Hey, Mondo, boyo. Yo. Hey, man. You about to head in? Yeah, has everyone already gone on ahead? <laughs> Looks that way. I don't like it. But nothing good's gonna come out from ignoring that gosh dang bear. Um, Mondo? Are you sure you're okay? You kinda went all out in that sauna. What? Huh? Who went all out? That crud doesn't even phase me. Yo. But you know. <laughs> there, at the edge of hell, a promise between men was waiting for me. Never saw it coming. Yo. Anyway, let's get our butts into the gym. And something unique must have happened between the two of them. I guess so. Oh, I guess it's time to go. Oh, but man, oh man, I already know that like right now, right? This series ha is this series is in go mode guys this series has to get farther in at this point in time farther than it actually is right now and that's because on the 23rd yes after before this video comes out 
uh, one of the series is ending, and it's the 15th right now, and I only am on chapter two. I think I have like 11 episodes right now so far, in which not bad, but could be better. I'll bet that's like a month and a week, I guess, worth of content. It's kind of, uh, I think I'm just doing way too many different series at the same time. You know, there's Luigi's Mansion, there's, um, two that I'm also doing, and then that, I mean, I just got done with Luigi's Mansion 2, but Luigi's Mansion 2 took up quite a bit of my time to be ahead for October, um, but not only that, so that I could also play with Cloud when she finishes the game. Um, and then, like, there's also two other, uh, series that I'm also going to have to work on as well. So, there's a lot on my plate. So, if any series has to get pushed out and has to be pushed out fast, it has to be this one because it's so far ahead. Hey, Hifumi, what are you doing here? Hey, Hifumi, look, we haven't gone in yet. What? What? Uh, what is that? Mr. Nyagi, don't scare me like that. But sorry, but we really should go inside. <laughs> no, don't go. You can't go. Mm -hmm. That's what my ghost friend is telling me. I don't feel good about it either, but... We can't just ignore this. <laughs> Dang, that's true too. I suppose... I guess we have no choice. I have to go too. I feel like we probably should have went and tried to see if we could get Byakuya. <clears throat> hmm, asking us to gather today all of a sudden like this. What could he possibly want? Well... Indeed, what might await us this time? <laughs> <laughs> he keeps... No, wait, that's not the right voice. <laughs> he keeps things interesting, that's for certain. Um, How is that funny? Can't you smile like a normal person once in a while? Like how the housewife on a classic TV show smiles at the end of an episode. What the heck? There's something totally messed up with you if you can laugh at a time like this. <laughs> Which of us is... Actually messed up. Hmm. Huh? What? What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Nothing in particular. Just admiring. That's all. Admiring what? Admiring what, Biakia? Pray tell. What are you admiring about Aoi? I don't want to kill anyone. But I also don't want to stay here. Living in blind denial day after day? <laughs> I was just admiring how you could live like that and still keep your sanity. Oh, okay, well then, that's fine. What is this? I'm not in denial. <laughs> this ain't Egypt, you know. That reminds me. Remember how you kept talking about how the police or what... Whoever would come and help us. How'd that turn out? It seems to me there's no sign of whatsoever of a possible rescue. Well... Th that's just... Huh? I... I wonder what actually happened. Certainly. It's strange that's true. There's no way the police wouldn't know about it. We're right in the middle of a major urban area. What? The police suck! Hmm... On the contrary, the mastermind may be that powerful to take control even of the police. Could it be...? Oh, the... I, I keep... I don't remember his voice. You know what? He could be like, Ah, this might not be related, but... <laughs> then to... Please don't say it. Hmm... Nope. Gonna say it. It's not like some occult. It's about mystery. last night. I never hear the main hall. Just I was never I was near the main hall, just staring up into space. 
when all of a sudden, I heard it. Huh? You heard what? Hmm. A sound that I don't really know what it is. Or it was. What kind of sound? Hmm. Well, like I said, I don't really know. But if I had to describe it... Could it be... It was like a construction site, I guess. A construction site. For serious. I mean, I could just be making that up. I only barely heard anything. <laughs> then you definitely made it up. M must have been the sound of the ocean in that head of yours. Hey. Uh, I don't know who this is. Say what? Who are you talking about, Toko? Is it really Monokuma? Why, well, hello! <sighs> He's arrived. <laughs> what Hero heard wasn't the sound of construction! But it could have been an explosion! Huh? Yeah. <laughs> or maybe a machine gun! <laughs> that kind of sounds like construction in a way! What are you talking about? What? Ah! 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 Beyond this point, my mouth is zipped! My lips are sealed! I'm fully puckered. It's a secret little secret. And? Oh wow. That 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 like pan to the right, that was wild. I don't know why. It just felt really forced and I didn't like it. Fine. And let's move on to what you can tell us. Why did you call us all here? Say what? You don't beat around the old bush, do you? You ready for me to get to the point, huh? If you please. Oh, uh, but before that, you mind if I vent a little? I'm low on energy these days. My stitching's even losing all of its shine and luster. I'm thinking it's probably become of this ho hum, boring, old, everyday life. I'm looking for something with a little more stimulation! Something rife with danger and intrigue! Yep. Listen, can I just be Frank? My name's Frank now. Just call me Frank. Today, I'm feeling what? black. The next blacken hasn't shown up yet! And I'm getting bored! Hey, um... No, oh, I've decided to... Come up with a new way to motivate you! M motivate? Is it another set of videos or something? Are you gonna show us some demented thing to try and drive us all to murder? It. Drive you to murder? What a mean thing to say! Just awful! Why would you suggest that? Game on you, Nagy. Well, dang, man, I'm just saying. That's kind of what you do. No, no, it is not. I don't drive you to murder. You guys murder on your own accord, you know? That's beyond the point of... Regardless! I don't know what you've got planned, but we're not going to kill each other anymore. Got it. No matter what you do, I swear to the Lord, we won't! Hmm, hmm. that's very big talk. Do your very best to back it up, okay? Now then, with your permission, let me begin! So this time it's... Embarrassing memories and... Oh, secrets. As long as you're alive, it's a given that there's things you don't want other people to know about you! So I did a little investigating of my own, and I dug up some of your darkest secrets. And those embarrassing memories and secrets are all contained in the envelopes I have right here. You know, honestly, my voice, my, I feel like I've gotten so much better at doing Monokuma's voice 
but now it's not really that taxing and I'm actually very appreciative. I'm going to hand them out now. So take a second to take a peek. Okay. As Monokuma spoke, he tossed the envelopes at our feet. I quickly snatched the envelope with my name written on it. I nervously pulled out what was written inside. And my entire body suddenly went rigid. Makoto wet the bed until he was in fifth grade. What? What? <laughs> uh, how? How did you find out about this? Everyone started talking at once. <laughs> you have 24 hours. If someone doesn't become blackened by then, Scream! all of your deepest, darkest, most embarrassingest secrets will be exposed to the world. Oh my goodness. Maybe I'll roll by a crowded intersection in a van strapped with loudspeakers and spill the beans! Yeah! <laughs> oh, wouldn't that be so embarrassing? Uh, so, that's what you meant by motivate? <laughs> yep! You got it! They're all pretty unpleasant! Trust me! None of you want me to reveal that stuff, right? It's definitely something I'd rather... Oh, wait, no. Do uh, you see? Now I'm you! This is what the next thing you'll say is. It's definitely something I'd rather not people know about, but... It's definitely something I'd rather not know the other people know about, but... Oh! We never kill over something like that. What? What'd you say? Count on it. He's right. Your plan is doomed to fail. No one's gonna murder someone for this kind of a thing. This is kind of depressing. Uh, oh no. Is it because for better or worse, your memory is still a way to connect to the outside world? I have stuff I wouldn't want anyone to know no matter what. So I assumed you'd all be the same. Which is why I put so much effort into preparing this next motive. And you're saying you really won't kill each other over this stuff? Oh, that, that just sucks. Well, what can you do? Okay, then in 24 hours, I'll expose all your secrets just to make myself feel a little better. Okay. Uh, so sad. So depressed. They're not well. With almost... With an almost convincing look of depressed dejection on his face, Anokuma receded to the gym's depths. So, um... I didn't know what to expect at first, but maybe we dodged a bullet on this one? Um... I mean, yeah, having those secrets revealed is gonna be totally embarrassing. But that's seriously not enough to give someone a reason to kill, right? Listen to me! Good news, everyone! I have a brilliant idea! You hear me? Why don't we all just confess the secrets in those envelopes right here and now? Without a doubt. If we do that, any and all motive for murder will vanish. That's pretty smart, right? Quiet down and listen! Okay, so my embarrassing thing is... <laughs> I d don't want to hear your stupid story. <gasps> what? <laughs> Besides, I don't... I don't want to talk about it. I don't care what anyone says. I don't want to talk ab about mine. As for me... Neither do I. Not because it's unpleasant. Well, because it's a, it is impossible. Oh? Well, it's just human nature to want to hear it when you say it's impossible. Come on, it'll be good for you. <sighs> Absolutely not. Come on, come it's on. It's okay, just a little bit. Come on. Come on. Come on. Honestly. As I said. Here we go. 
Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Hey! I said I don't want to talk about it, you human bag of lard! Say what? Yeah! <laughs> oh, I agree with them. There's no need to discuss it. Uh, what do you think, Chihiro? Uh, I'm sorry. Um, sorry. I don't really want to talk about it right now. But, but... But I also don't want to leave things the way they are. Maybe I can talk about it later. After I try my best, come strong, then I can tell everyone. So, um... If you don't want to talk, you don't have to. I'm not super excited to talk about it either. That's true. If everyone's that much against it, even if my bro's the one that suggested it, I gotta say no. <laughs> well, well, that's okay then. Either way, if it's just a few secrets, I'm sure nobody will kill anyone over it. I hope you're right. Secret's so bad you'd kill someone to keep it. Nobody's got something like that, right? <clears throat> okay, I'll stop with all the secret talk. But... You hear me? Each of us has 24 hours to get ready. Having our secrets exposed isn't going to be fun, but it's not like we're gonna die because of it. <clears throat> so, uh... You know... Uh... Don't do anything hasty? Well... The way you keep repeating it kind of makes me worry even more. Oh, uh, okay. Sorry. I know it's gonna be tough, but... Time to run. Time to run! Nighttime already, huh? Okay, let's call it a day. Of course. Good idea. We need to prepare for tomorrow. I was left with an anxiety I just couldn't shake. But, we left things as they were, and left things as they lay. One by one, we headed back to our rooms. Secrets or memories you don't want anyone to know about. A way to connect to the outside world. Honestly, all that crud Monokuma was spouting didn't have any effect on me. There's no way anyone would kill over stuff like that. At least, that's what I thought. But maybe I was just being optimistic. Which is probably why that too much of a struggle. Uh, jeez. I'm more tired than usual! Super tired today. I fell asleep. <laughs> but what I didn't know is that even then, a tragedy was taking place. Oh, Monoguma Theater! Hey, do you have a second? I want to confide in you! Yes, you! The person right behind the screen! We're breaking the fourth wall now! It's about the prevailing world attitude right now! Probably when this game was made, not so much in, you know, 2024 when this game is being played! The difference between passive and active, I mean. For example, the difference between like, Oops, I killed him and, Yeah, that's right, I killed him! Amazingly, there are tons of people who don't understand the difference! Can you believe it? Well, there's a huge difference between oops and that's right! You know what I'm saying, right? Anyone can kill someone in the heat of the moment, but surprisingly few can do it with calculated intent. To make that choice, then put it into action. It's way harder than just letting your emotions lead you. It's all about preparation. Resolve! So maybe you're wondering, what's the point I'm trying to make? Well, I'm not totally sure myself. Maybe you should try reading between the lines. I really want to know what he means by that. I 
feel like there might have been like some kind of secret message or something. Morning. Good. Good morning. Good morning. Ah, frick. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> nice reaction. I'm glad you didn't disappoint. Oh, what? What are you doing in here? Yep. I wanted to spice things up. So instead of a school announcement, I decided to wake you up in person. What the hell for? <laughs> because it's fun. We're not going to talk about how the game just went on to auto for a second. Apparently, R is the auto. And as long as I'm here, I figured I'd let you hear it right from the bear's mouth. Hear what? <laughs> Are you sure you should be acting this laid back? I mean... Even though something happened to one of your buddy buddy classmates. What? Say what? <laughs> what? What? Your face is all blue, like someone on the verge of death. What? What happened? What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> That's for me to know and for you to find out. Good luck. Things happen to someone. Is it? Was it? No. It can't be. There's no way someone would. But. What if? No. What ifs are pointless. Especially now when. The dining hall. I need to get to the dining hall. And you know what? Should I end it here? This seems like the perfect time to kind of like just end it. No, we're, we'll keep going. It's a little longer because I, I got like eight minutes that I didn't really do. So it would be an extremely like short episode if those eight minutes are gone. Could have been six, could have been four. I don't really recall. Either way. Ah, uh, Makoto. Uh, um. Are, are you okay? Hey. Did Monokuma talk to you too? Hiro, Hina, Sakura, and... Byakuya. You're the only ones here? Where's everyone else? <laughs> Either they're already off trying to verify what Monokuma said, or they've fallen victim to the something that Monokuma mentioned. The... something? Perhaps. It can't be. Has it happened again? Mayday. After hearing what Madokuma had to say, the worst possibility forced its way into my mind. It took everything I had to drive that thought away. Uh, um. So, so if somebody really did happen, you know, like, does that mean that someone did it because of what happened yesterday? Huh? It can't be. That stuff was just a bunch of old memories. <laughs> just old memories. Don't be so sure about that. Clearly someone felt it was more important than that. Huh? <laughs> to judge someone else's values based on your own outlook. Don't you realize how dangerous that is? What the heck? What? Why didn't you say something yesterday? Naturally. Did you already forget? This isn't that co-op game. It's every man for himself. <laughs> what good does it do to, for me to go out of my way to help you? Just the worst. Stop saying that already. Uh, um. Uh, there's something wrong with him for serious. Did he get brainwashed or something? Wait, that's not important. What matters right now is that we find out what happened. That's fine. She's right. Let's all slid up and begin looking. Hmm, the game is afoot. Okay, I'm pretty sure my memory is correct. I don't think it's here. But it might be here.
I don't think it's here. It's in the second floor. Okay. So, uh, you know what? I, if I know exactly where it is, I'm gonna stop right before we get there. I want you guys to leave a comment down below. For those of you who don't know, who do you think it is? If you do know, well then, um... Hello. Then, uh, you know what? We gotta think of a different question for you, don't we? Um... You know what? Go ahead and let me know in the comments down below. Who's your least favorite character of this game? I'm pretty sure it's gonna be this guy for a lot of people. But honestly, I do not like Byakuya. And I don't really like Toko, to a degree. Like, you know, making friends with Toko, I eat that crud up. You know, like, I really like, um, you know, trying to make friends with Toko. But, um, I I'm not very fond of, like, the way that she basically goes about everything. And I think that, like, when I was, like, also playing this game and I got a lot of game overs, I'm pretty sure she's the one who points the most fingers at it being the main character who did everything. Even when nothing really points to the main character being the person to do something i don't know either way thank you all so very much for watching i hope you all enjoyed i know not much more content from when i said should i end it or not but this leaves it on a very good cliffhanger on who we think it is so thank you all so very much for watching and i'll see you all in the next part of school life Bye bye Kaka, kaka, kaka. Bye bye. I forgot I can use my mouse. Woo!